It's November 1st, 2022, uh, Tuesday afternoon, about 3.15. I'm Todd Dunn, and today I'm over at the Great Harbor Marina in Southwest Harbor. And we're going to take a look at the marina as it switches over into winter mode. Yep, seagull flying off. Okay, here we go. Here are the boats that are still in on the cross dock here, which is D-Dock. There's a blue pleasure boat at Grand Banks 36. A little boat, the Mel Temi, that belongs to the marina manager, so it doesn't really count. And then there's a little gravy white here. Uh, and then if we look a little further out, we can see a sailboat. And then a big Hinkley cruiser. And past that, there is one more sailboat, a couple of schooners that are here for the winter. As we move over here, there are some lobster boats, another schooner, that's the Margaret Todd, which does uh, two-hour cruises out of Bar Harbor in the summer, and one sailboat out there uh, that belongs to a friend of mine who works for the Hinkley Company. And just on the cross dock there, you can see a Hinkley picnic boat, and then right next to it is a brand new Hinkley Talaria 34. You can tell it's new because it's gray and it hasn't been painted yet. It's here for sea trial. Then over on Sea Dock, the last dock, there are two Hinkley power boats and another big power cruiser. I'm pretty sure those have been put there by the Hinkley company who uses that dock to get boats ready to haul out. And there's a sailboat on the other side which may be a Hinkley service boat or it may be a transient but the marina is definitely switching over into full winter mode where in a few uh, days it'll pretty much only be work boats, lobster boats, and a few uh, boats that are stored here at the marina for the winter. Since they installed the breakwater you can see out there, this marina is very well protected even in the worst storms here and is a good place to tie your boat up for the winter. Keeping your boat here for the winter is quite a bit cheaper than hauling out and putting it in storage if you have a big boat. For a smaller boat, it's kind of a wash. If you have a 30-footer, it's about the same cost to haul out and go to inside storage as it is to keep the boat here. Uh, the harbor here doesn't freeze very much. Occasionally, in a really cold snap in the winter, we will have a few days where there's some skim ice. But that's it, and it never lasts more than four or five days. So the water is uh, below the top couple of inches, above freezing, and it's not uh, a bad place to keep your boat because of that. So, Marina's almost into full winter mode as things wind down for the 2022 season here in Southwest Harbor, Maine. Okay, that wraps up this quick video. I just wanted to show you what the Marina looks like here in Southwest Harbor today. Uh, the day after the end of the season for pleasure boaters. And I say that because most pleasure boat insurance policies require the boat to be laid up or hauled out uh, by the end of October. And the boats that are left in the water now, uh, either hanging on moorings or here at the marina, uh, are either waiting for the storage companies to haul them out or in the case of some of these boats here at the marina, they may be overwintering here. They'll be officially laid up. So it's better to leave your boat here at the marina than it is to leave it on a mooring, which people do occasionally, but not very often. Uh, because uh, you can go down to the boat and check it. If it snows, you can get the snow off of it and basically uh, keep an eye on it easily. You don't have to get in a dinghy and row out to your boat in sub-freezing weather when the wind is blowing like stink. Okay, so that wraps this video up. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.